Hello YouTube, my name is Dragon and welcome to episode 49 of Shadow vs. Champions Battle Let's Play. So, we can go to the National Championship now, but first of all, we're gonna finish all of our side quests. We have one regular side quest left, and after that we only have some character side quests left, which are Kagura's, Maros, and Lucas. But let's start with this one. At long last, he goes right before my eyes. I merely need to finish in touches, a delectable dessert and drink. There is no time to waste. And yet I find myself in need of inspiration. Like always. It looks like Marcel could use some help. Should I talk to him? Yes. Ah, but this is my greatest inspiration. You have come at the perfect time. Okay. My new focus meal is nearly finished. All that is left is the drink and dessert. The dessert must embody neutrality. A perfect balance of darkness and light. The very essence of dark angel Olivia. Yeah, we, we have that one. And the drink must somebody dragon craft contains the raging fires of a dragon within, the very essence of the Ignis dragon. Isn't that Hero's signature card? The Ignis dragon is highly coveted, but I'm sure you of all people can find it. I just know you will find a way to inspire me, yes? After all, you have never filled me before. This full cost menu shall be completed yet, mark my words. Okay, well, we have those. Yes. Can it be Dark Angel Olivia and the Ignis dragon? Oh, I can feel it. Inspiration flowing through my veins. I know just what to do for my appetizer and soup now. Appetizer and soup? Did I read that wrong? Did I just make that up? Appetizer and soup, it was dessert and drink, right? Anyway. I present to you the dessert. A dark zen black su sucher tort. With a dollop of fresh cream. And for the drink, a fairy draconic ginger ale. Okay. From within a bitter nose of chocolate emerges a gentle burst of sweetness and a perfect finale, an intense yet refreshing drink to wash it all down. And with that, the finishing touches are complete. My new focus meal is ready to serve. But I could not have done it without you, my greatest inspiration. Money. Oh, the champion of cookery. Hello. Okay. I have reached new eyes since the culinary arts. This Fukur's menu will surely be fitted for the gods. But you have not seen the last of Marcel Sabeoka. There is always a higher peak to set your sights on. Not only in cooking, but in shadowverse as well. Okay. So that seems to be the last of Marcel's quests. Who should we do? Should we do Moro? Yeah, let's do Moro. Our poor boy's sad. Let's help him out. Maro, dear. Hello. Oh. Should I ask Maro about the Book of Forgotten Folk Tales? Yes. You're asking if that's really the end? Please. Of course it's the end. For the story and for me. It can end this way. What does it matter to you? You know, you really are a soft touch. And that's exactly what makes you easy prey. Great! There has to be more to the story, I just know it. We managed to find some pages, but I'm afraid the book itself is still nowhere to be found. Oh yeah, they still have some pages, right? Hey, that's right, the Joubert sisters mentioned that they had some of the pages. Could they have the real ending? I guess there's only one way to find out. Okay. Let's check it out. I don't think they're willing to share, though. Why, good evening. Could it be that you found the book for us? I did. But not for you. Uh, Sorry. I see. So you've been looking for it, too. Let me get this straight. You got the book, and now you're here to snag the last pages from us, huh? That's kind of awkward, isn't it? Please, I really need them. All right. How about this? Beat me in a match and they're yours. Oh no. <laughs> but if you lose, you got to hand over everything you got. Book and all. What do you think, sis? <laughs> Sounds fair to me. No. Sweet. About time I got to have some fun around here. That's not fair, the whole book. Oh god, I better not lose. Or that book's as good as ours. Shadowverse, showdown! 
Okay, I think I'm my right deck equipped, so... I don't know, we beat her once before. If we get a little lucky, we should be able to do it. <laughs> I mean, yeah, we, we should be fine, right? All right, second, please. Good starting and please. Okay, yes, I like it. It's not bad at all. I'm gonna prefer to start second though. Okay, first, yes, one cost card. What you got? Okay, that's good. Two cost, two cost. Oh no. Air boy. <laughs> that's not good. Okay. Ooh, skeleton raider. Hello. Alright, direct damage and turn. Thoughts. Okay. Well, uh, we can't evolve yet. That sucks. Mm. Alright, for the patroller. One damage and turn. The Reaper of Madness, her ace. I don't know. I don't think it's that scary. But she's gonna evolve it, though. That's a little bit scary. Okay, yeah, that sucked. That wasn't good at all. Oh boy. Uh, let's see. Evolve you. We really don't have a choice if we want to stop getting damaged like this. And then, uh, yeah, let's just get rid of that thing, right? Or, yeah. Wait! What happened? Did you do that? What happened? What did I do? Oh no. <laughs> what happened there? Oh my god, this is very bad. You four damage. Hmm. Playful Necromancer. Evolve. Uh, it's not going well at all. At freaking all. Get rid of that thing. Last words destroy a random follower. Oh my god, I'm so freaking dumb. I hate it. I hate it. Of course, that's why he did that. I should read. Why do I not read? This is the worst. This is the absolute freaking worst at this point. There's nothing that can save us now. <laughs> Oh my god, why? Why? Help! Help me! <laughs> I think we're done! Oh my god, that was actually the worst! Okay. Let's try that again, because this was terrible. We're gonna do that again. Yes, let's try again. I feel like it will help if I just get to go second. That just makes me feel better. <laughs> why? For the love of God, why? Three cost? Okay, that's better. Four cost. At least we have one, two now. And turn. Let's hope she doesn't summon anything. That'd be a great start. Hey, that's how I like it. All right. Ooh, Lord of the Flies. Hello, buddy. I like that in the back. Okay. Now a three cost card would be very nice. Okay, let's summon you then. 
Uh, attack this. Let's get rid of this thing, right? And let's hope it destroys Skull Crater Widow. That's the only thing I really didn't want it to destroy. God. Oh, again. That card freaking sucks, man. I swear to God. Why not this one? <laughs> That'd be the worst one you could destroy, man. Okay. Attack and turn. I'm guessing, yeah, she can evolve now. Okay. Oh, I hate it. I hate it. That's so unfair. Okay, come on. Mm, how much does it do? Only two, though. Ah, uh, summon two zombies. I mean, that's not bad. All right, no, let's just do it like this. Should we evil for rabbit necromancer to get rid of that thing? I think we should. Because then it can damage us. And next to that... Like, we do two damage to her. Okay. So the next turn, we could summon Lord of the Flies. Okay. Hmm... Choices, 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 right? Maybe let's summon death spread. Be careful here. And turn. Of course. Of course. That should destroy that, but then the Lich gets summoned. And she's evolving the Lich as well. Jesus Christ. Okay, chill, girl. And we're summoning ghosts, apparently. Cool. Cool. Hmm. Let's see. An undead outbreak won't kill it. We'll do two damage. Lord of the Flies won't kill it either. It depends on what we get when we summon Lord of the Flies. Let's summon our Lord of the Flies and hope it gets the one that gets to attack. Like the one with Bane? Not that one. Like, at all. Hmm. Okay, but if we evolve this thing... And then... Uh, attack. Man, this one should attack this one. She can't evolve anymore. Man, I guess she could pull something to save her. Okay, you're doing that too, huh? That's cool. That one again. Alright, I think... And that outbreak. And just... Attack. Attack. But Necromancer, this sucks. Please, please don't attack this one. I'm not... Uh, okay, and turn. I don't want him to get damaged any more than this. Just attack something else. Oh, Mordecai! Mordecai! No! No, why? This is upsetting! Very upsetting. Now we're just kind of screwed, aren't we? We have to pull something very good now. I'm guessing she's gonna attack directly. Yep. 
breathing too loud. Come on. Oak. No. No. Ah, stop. Oh, this is not gonna help anymore. Frick, man. We were doing so well, too. Okay, I'm gonna try this again. <laughs> okay, I think we may be here. Because she's gonna have to... Attack my defending monsters. I'm scared. I'm scared. Oh, dang it! Okay, but I think I think we are still there. Like Venom Hall, right? Attack. One, two, and three. And there goes Vivian. This was like my fifth try, and it was actually pretty hard. I wasn't expecting it to be because we won once before, but uh we managed at least. Okay. That got quite scary there. <laughs> Now, hand me over the pages. <laughs> Never a dull moment with you, kid. Sorry, sis. I screwed up. You did. Well, no matter. That's just the way it goes sometimes. That being said, a deal's a deal. These pages are yours. Thank you. So, what do they say? Kid like you. You better be grateful. <laughs> A pleasure as always. Anyway, until next time. Ciao. Bye bye. Now let's read what it says. I finally got my hands on the final pages. Let's see what they say. I have to tell Moro right away. Is it something good? The final level. Hey, Maro. What is it now? There were more pages to the book. And what does that have to do with me? It changes nothing. The boy is doomed to live out his life in despair. <laughs> That's all there is to it, right? I hope not. Just read it. This is such a waste of time. It's time for Mara to know the truth. The evil god told the boy this was all a trick of my design. It never was a fable jewel. There's no hope for you, only despair. The boy could not gain his freedom. He was doomed to live a cursed life forevermore. Yet the boy did not despair, for he did in fact have hope. That hope lay in the bonds he had forged with his companion, the traveler. What they shared was more of a treasure to him than any jewel could have ever been. The evil god asked him, Why do you not despair? And the boy replied, Because my journey will never end. But that the boy and the traveler joined hands and despaired from the evil god's sight. And as the two continued their journey together for years to come, their smiles never fading. Oh. I don't believe it. Could he have known the true ending all along? No. It can't be. You simply exceeded his expectations. Who is this guy he keeps talking about? Yeah. It's a foolishness beyond compare. And yet, I find myself in your debt. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> now the story is truly complete. I'll leave the book in your hands. Think of it as a souvenir of our adventure together. I am kind of glad we don't have to fight Morrow again. We had to do Vivian, thank God. Are you sure? Bye. story also here take this as a token of my appreciation for your help oh his ace the god of curses that's cool and the figurine the god of curses is a symbol of despair since you showed me the light i thought i'd give you a little something from the opposite end of the spectrum all right sure thanks well, i should be going to report that I've completed my mission, after all. The boy in the story was able to find his answer. And who knows? Maybe with your help, 
I'll be able to find mine too. I trust that's not too much to ask. After all, I know now. You're my one and only chance to find hope. Okay. If you say so. After class. We have a new message. I must admit that this is all thanks to you. I might even have a future now. Thank you. I mean it. Oh, Mauro. Alright, guys. I am going to end this episode right here. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.